Welcome back, everybody, at long, long last to Modded Minecraft. Now, it has been, well, I just, like I just said, <laughs> it has been a really long time since I've played. <clears throat> and um, just a few things to talk about before we get started here. Um, as cor Of course, as soon as I start recording, my birds start going crazy in the background. But um, that's the thing. Um, I'm back home for the winter break, if you didn't already know. Which means that I brought home my microphone, but I didn't bring home my other equipment, like my pop filter, and amongst other things. So, um, I apologize if every time I make a P sound, it sounds horrible, but that's just the way it's going to be for this session. Um, and I apologize if the birds come through really loudly in the background, because I'm back at home with them. And uh, they're, they're just as loud as they always were, unfortunately, so... That's the way it's going to be. Now, if you can't, if you didn't read here, 57 mods, um, that does mean, in fact, that I did I did strip down on the mods. Um, I didn't put nearly as many in as I used to. Um, not just, I don't know, for a few reasons. Just to, for one, just to strip down. I didn't. I took out the mods that had absolutely no use to me. I mean, why, why, ha why have them in there? I mean, and the second reason being that I was having problems with. Uh, crashing a lot which is why it's been so long since this series has resumed um yeah um m my previous world the one that was under the lake from the from the series i'm just gonna i'm just, yeah but the, the, that that world got corrupted and deleted so i had to make a new house which i will go ahead and give you a tour of now because why why not so uh here you go uh for the first time ever I'm not in a snow. I'm not in snow biome, so there you go. I oh, actually, actually, I take it back. I did spawn in a snow biome, but um, I moved. I didn't want to be in a snow biome again. So um, let me go ahead and go in creative mode here, so I can give you like a flyover of the house here, because I thought it's pretty cool. Um, I didn't want to bore you guys with the the, the building process again. So uh, here you go. I think it's pretty cool, right? 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 All right. So. If you were fear, yeah. If you were to theoretically come in from the main entrance, which is here, you would go. You could go up the stairs, and um, here's my bed. Here's a teleporter. Oh, I should say that this is a a new teleportation mod. For some reason, the TF2 teleporters were crashing me. Um, like it wouldn't crash it when I would put them in. It wouldn't crash when I would place the teleporter down, but it would. It would crash when I tried to. Uh, adjust the frequency of the teleporters so i had to take out tf2 teleporters but i know how helpful it ha i know how helpful it is to have teleporters so i looked for another mod and this one i found so the way this teleporter mod works is um you get these stones right you have to build these stones which i already did off camera obviously and um let's say let's say this one is this one is assigned i named this one home right so I could be I could be anywhere in the world basically uh, in in this dimension at least, and then I would just right I would right click on with that uh, with that redstone in my hand and it would take me back to the redstone platform. So that's pretty cool. Um, the only the only drawback to it is it costs an ender pearl, which whatever I have plenty of that. So let's continue on with the tour. Here's like going to be uh, the, I guess the crafting room. Crafting table, uncrafting table. Two anvils which I will probably never use. Uh, furnaces and a trash disposal. Why not? So that's that. Um, we have the uh, the chest room. I'll go ahead and show you what's in the chest. Here's like the tree chest. I got some saplings of some special trees and from the twilight forest I guess. Ender pearl stocking. Stock. Uh, food and all that good stuff. Uh, nothing in there yet. Twilight Forest box. All this random stuff. Yay. Uh, materials, I guess. And uh, random, more random stuff. So, there you go. I try to keep it actually semi-organized. It probably will not last very long because I'm an or unorganized person. But, yeah. Um, here's a library if I want to enchant stuff. Which I believe I have 25 levels right now. So, I could do that if I want, actually. Um, here's the alchemy room, which, to be honest with you, I built it. I have no idea 
if I, I'll probably never end up being in here because I still don't know how to do alchemy. I, I don't know. Maybe. It's here if I need it, but I don't know if I'll ever use it. And then finally, here's Twilight Forest. Now, I know that in that update video, I mentioned that I wasn't going to have Twilight Forest in it because I've already cleared and done everything. I was wrong. Um, there's two things I haven't finished yet, which I forgot about. Uh, number one, which is what I'm going to do first in this series, I presume, is going to be the Goblin Fortress or Stronghold, whatever, whatever it's called. There's a Goblin Stronghold or something, and I want to do that. So I will go ahead and do that, I, I, I guess. Um, <laughs> yeah, so I'll do that. Once I get done with this room tour, or house tour, I suppose. And, um, yeah. And then after that, the other thing I haven't done Twilight Forest yet is, uh, the, what's it called? Uh, the Labyrinth. Uh, I've been in the Labyrinth multiple times, like, probably once every series I've had so far that's had Twilight Forest. So I've been there, like, three times or so. And I've been, dis I've been destroyed every time I've been there. But I think I have the capabilities of being successful in there now. We'll see. But, um... Basically, the, all these teleporter stones represent what I want to do. There you go. Goblin Fortress. Labyrinth. Um, that's just uh, to get back to the Twilight Forest portals. Not that. Um, Nether Fortress. There's, I have a teleportation stone to that, so I can go there. Uh, not that. Uh, Miner's Deluxe. That's another dimension that I want to... And there's a stronghold. I found a stronghold in this over in this overworld. As I have it marked over there. It's 800 meters away, but I have a teleporter to take me there. So I can go to a stronghold too. I can go to the end if I want to, which I am not going to. Well, I'm not going to yet because uh, I'm definitely not powerful enough. But um, yeah, if you can't see those trees over there, I went ahead and planted some cool Twilight Forest trees because why not? They're cool. So that's the uh, that's above that's the the upper levels, and I will just go ahead and quickly show you what's below ground. Not too much down here, but. All right, so here's the teleport, teleporter, or, or portal room. That's what I should say. Um, as of right now, only have two portals. If you don't count the Twilight Forest one, maybe I'll add more eventually. But you know, the like I, like I already mentioned in the update video, Divine RPG is completely broken right now. So until they update that to not beta stage, I will not put Divine RPG in because that fucked everything up. So, and I've also gotten into the habit of uh, backing up my world after every session so here's a little nether wart farm not a huge purpose of this more for aesthetics but if i want nether wart i can get it and uh then the garden i always have to have a garden even though i never like harvest it it's here <laughs> so hey spider what's going on what you doing up there all right then all right <clears throat> okay then so that it concludes the the house tour. So what I want to do first is uh, uh, and this is for the holidays. So it's Christmas tree. And so what I want to do first is uh, go to the Twilight Forest. Let's get out of this game mode. And I want to go to the Goblin Fortress and hopefully not die, which I probably will. But it's okay. Yeah. Hmm. I feel like I should keep put the keep inventory mod on. Or do I have any charms of keeping? Maybe I do? Uh... I don't, apparently. Hang on a second. Oh! That was not what I wanted to do. Alright, so hopefully that pause and resume feature on my screen recording software actually works. Otherwise, this entire session is going to be wasted. But either way, um, I grabbed some ender pearls. And I'm actually hu I'm hungry. need to get some... F which one's my food? It's gotta be this one, right? Yep. Um, yeah, let's grab some food. I'll take half of those, I guess. I need to I need to cook them actually. Um let's see, that is four worth. Yeah. Okie doke. Let's go ahead and cook these bad boys. I can divide these up, I think. That should be more efficient, I believe. I will definitely not need this much food, but it doesn't hurt. All right, so we'll just wait for that to finish up, and then we will head on over to the Twilight Forest, because it's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. Whoop. I did not mean to do that. Okay. 
All right. So, I'm excited. It's been a long time since I've played Minecraft, so I, I've definitely not uh, overplayed. That's for certain. Um, I guess we can go ahead and sleep while that stuff cooks. It's not going to speed up the process, but at least we can make it daytime. Why not? There you go. And if I don't, I don't remember if I've ever actually slept in there. So if I hadn't, then I just set my spawns. That's cool. All right, so it's almost done here. So yeah, I believe I showed you guys everything about this house. Not too much to it. Um, I am happy that I can finally make an over overground house instead of having to dig myself into a cave. It's kind of cool because uh, although I have I don't have mo creatures in, which is unfortunate because I like most of the mo creatures. With mo creatures also comes the ogres who destroy everything. And when I say everything, I really do mean everything. They will wreck your shit up, and it's just annoying. So didn't want to well i mean it's not a matter of whether or not i wanted to play with ogres it's a matter of that um mo creatures isn't updated yet so i couldn't play with ogres if i wanted to so um we got our food 